tracking down evidence in the murder of Bella Bond. Today, the jury heard from detectives who found the weighted bag that the little girl was in before her body washed ashore. WBC's Nicole Jacobs is live in Boston. Nicole. Kate, right now they're also hearing from another state trooper who pinpointed baby Bella's clothing to the store target. He says based on that investigation, he knocked on 100 doors trying to locate anyone who might be connected with this little girl. Also, this morning, there were questions related to the cell phone activity between Michael McCarthy and Rochelle Bond. A Massachusetts State Police Sergeant analyzing cell phone activity between Michael McCarthy's phone and a phone associated with Rochelle Bond, tracking an area in South Boston where baby Bella's body was dumped and an area near Deer Island where she washed ashore. The exact location in South Boston the day after Bella was discovered is unclear despite the pings. The precision he likens to a game of catch with Tom Brady. I'm going to play catch with Tom Brady. Tom Brady is kind of like the tower. Great arm. I don't have a great arm. Tom Brady can throw the ball to me 80 yards away. I'm the cell phone. If I want to throw it back to him, I have to get close to that tower to be able to throw it to Tom. But it was clear what the state police dive team was searching for near the reserve channel in South Boston. To look for possibly a bag and some type of weighted objects. Retired trooper yeah, Scott yeah, McKenzie yeah, spent yeah. five minutes in nine foot waters before he made a discovery near Black Falcon Pier. I saw a green military style duffel bag as well as uh, some weightlifting plates. The bag in which prosecutors say baby Bella was dumped. Defense attorney Jonathan Shapiro contends that's not enough to point to his client. You can't tell us how they got there. No. Or who put them there. No. I have no further questions. The state trooper who continues to be on the stand right now regarding those leggings and other uh, evidence that was found, he says that if the person who purchased the leggings was able to produce those leggings and show him the leggings once he knocked on the door, he knew they weren't connected to baby Bella. However, none of those door knocks led him to Bond or McCarthy. We're live in Boston. Nicole Jacobs, WBZ News.